Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev, welcome back to this let's play of Banished. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. Finish these buildings. Gimme! Now I don't have a resource air in a stockpile anywhere nearby here, so that they have to carry these goods quite a distance. I mean, uh, that doesn't bother me, but it <laughs> probably bothers them a fair bit. Oh, all the materials are actually delivered to the bridge. Cool. Nice wooden bridge there. Okay, so... Ah, right, we wanted to go through here. But start there. Seventy-two stone, yeah, do it. And then we connect the road. Like here. And out here. Probably gonna build another one through the tunnel through here as well. People are dying old, of old age. Only five kids left in the whole village. So we're definitely gonna have that problem. Are you actually walking around to deliver? Yes, we are. We're walking all the way around. Yeah. On the bright side, that means we can start gathering materials here. Is there any iron here? I don't think so. Oh yeah, that's a problem. I think I draw the, drew the tunnel from here and over to this side, right? So now the workers are going to go all the way around to deliver the stone on this side. No. Good. They are they are smart enough to do around whatever, whatever side they can access. Good. Whew. Bit concerned there. And that also means that these folks can actually cross this whole area now. I mean, they can cross the bridge and they can walk across here and over to the bad area, if need be. It's gonna speed it, speed it up quite a bit once you have the tunnel. Of course, this tunnel requires a ton of stone. And I have a feeling that the builders are gonna prioritize that one now over these gathering buildings, but that is okay. Give me this one so we can connect this. Because then you can draw from the labor pool up there. Probably a bit easier than across this area. I don't know. Maybe. Happiness is starting to go down quite a bit. going down. Why? They're not sick. They have food. They have clothes. They have tools. They have firewood. Could be simply because of deaths. And we do not have a chapel. Or a hospital. Okay, fair enough. We're gonna build a chapel all the way down here by the town hall. It doesn't have a circle, right? No, it doesn't. It did. That's 130 stone, though. So if we plant that one down, we're not gonna be building anything else. 
I'll have to wait for the tunnel to finish first. Which shouldn't take that long, actually. Oh yeah, and gather everything of stone here as well. There we go, tunnel is going up. Now I did see the workers go up here I think, so I don't think we need a tunnel here. At least not yet. Tunnel is done, yay! Let's see, we want to build a road from that nook all the way over there. Um, you probably are going to go the shortcut there, but I think I will go the long route. Let's see. Didn't I build a forest to start there? Yes, I did. So. Wait, can't I build straight here? There's something here blocking the road. Oh, it's just a surface stone, so... It's not gonna be there forever. It's gonna have a few gaps there. <laughs> That's fine. Let there be gaps. We'll fix it later. Okay, now that the tunnel is done, I think we can set down the chapel. It's okay. We're the stuff out there is just food buildings. So for now, I suppose the chapel is okay. Even though it's going to take away all our stone and then some. Then again, they can now harvest all the stone here. Should be able to at least. Even using the tunnel. Yep, they're using the tunnel. Oh, did I. No, it was a straight road. see eventually. We'll see our screw-ups. Food supply is still going up. Very nice. Oh, that's why they're pissed. The graveyard is full. So, guess we're going to build a much larger cemetery. There we go. All the timber has been delivered, not all the stone, we have completely out of stone. And we're out of iron as well. I'm just going to lower the tool cap to 300. Well, someone's freezing, that's not good. That graph. And we still need to hit 300. My god, how are we gonna do that? We need to get way more communities, all these little uh, forestry communities producing food than we currently have, otherwise, we'll never get anywhere near. Ah. I 
Oh, well, we'll keep trying. Eventually we'll get there, I think. Yeah, population's actually down. We have ordered 120 earlier. So, we are having a slight demographics issue. Can't really build anything on the... Of course, we can't dock to the chapel now. And we're out of laborers. I'm kind of very hesitant to cutting the number of food produce producers. I very much want that stockpile to be huge. I wouldn't mind having like 50,000 food stockpiled. I will give it time. They did harvest all the stone over there, so then they are doing what I tell them to do. Not instantly, but they are doing it. And right, of course, since I started this whole area, they cleared this one first. It's so much stone. Still, we're almost done with the stone for the chapel. Then you need to deliver the stone for the... Uh, graveyard. Trampled by a wild war, oh dear. I'm starting to think that nomads just won't show up. It might actually need a trading post too, I don't know. I don't know, let's see, 97%, no education whatsoever. Three children now. Only 30 homes, yeah, we need more houses. Badly. We're out of laborers. Gonna cut gatherers and fishermen a little bit there. Need a larger labor pool. Need them to go out and touch me stone and stuffs. And replace, of course, the old age folks. Yeah. This is gonna be so problematic. Hopefully the entire town won't die of old age. Oh god, did everybody do this cranky again? Yeah, well, we'll see. Once a new chapel is up and a new graveyard is up, then things are gonna be... Even. Well, their morale is gonna improve. Their happiness should improve. And then we have the slight issue of getting more homes built. Could build some homes right next to the chapel. There we go, chapel is done. Uh, let's get one of the clerics. This isn't really where I want the homes to be built, but... Uh, we kind of need some homes. And that's on the very edge of the market ring, right? Yeah, that's fine. Just need a few new homes so that we get more children. That's basically why I'm doing that. These have finally been cleared, so now they're starting to deliver the goods. And it looks like they've begun carrying the stones here. It's been a while since I told them to do that. It's all been marked for removal. 
It'll happen. Uh, oh, they have to walk quite a distance to actually deliver this stuff anywhere. Um, let's put a small stockpile here. Nothing fancy. And now we wait. Basically, we're waiting for stone at this point. And whatever graphics crisis makes it very difficult to increase the number of miners and stone miners. And these 40%. Oh, you're getting there. People are dying of old age. Over and over again, people are getting rather cranky. Two children in the whole village. One kid in the whole village. Yeah. We definitely have a demographics crisis. Uh, can I see the age of the population? No. Because that would be kind of useful. So, we need to cut back the number of fishers. Need laborers. Need the folks that run on the map and just harvest stuffs. And we're doing okay on food anyway, and since our population is dwindling, we might as well do this. Somebody dying old age. So many people still waiting for a, a home. Yeah, our population is going to go very low. I can guarantee you that. Then we're going to have a whole bunch of kids. And uh, the whole thing is going to just go in another cycle. Then we're going to be short of food again. And yeah, all that fun stuff. But you're used to this now, and as long as you have the buildings ready, it's gonna be fine. You can just scale up. And if we're lucky, we're actually gonna get some migrants. I'm really starting to wonder if I need something other than just a town hall. I thought I needed the boarding house. As far as everything I've read, it says just need this. So you can accept them, but I'm starting to think you need a trading post. And or a boarding house. Oh, the graveyard is being built. Excellent. At least we got that one done. Hopefully that's gonna curb some of the sadness. My goodness, are they sad. Oh, that might be it actually, because they're gonna be sad for deaths. But they're gonna be happy for childbirths. That could be it. There haven't been many child <laughs> children born in this village recently. dance now. Yes. Gather me some foods. I 
Let's see, you're a builder, right? Come on, let me click on you. Uh, you're a laborer, right? So you're going out here to just drop things. Or deliver materials, that's what you're doing. This continues. <sighs> and again, we're producing way more food. Now, I'm kind of reluctant to remove the number of hunters. Because I want the hides for clo clothes. So. <laughs> That's why I've been removing the fishermen and the gatherers rather than instead. Which is kind of strange, because the folks simply will not eat venison. They refuse to eat venison. I mean, they eat the other stuff way more than venison. I'm not sure why. Still, they ain't dying, and that's a good thing. Well, they aren't dying on starvation at the very least. They are dying. They're part of old age. Finish the stockpile, yes, we did. Okay. Hey, a new house. So now, this is gonna be. Now it's gonna get interesting. I wanna see just how old the folks that move into this place is. Or are, rather. We might have waited for too long with building more homes. gonna bite us in the butt. 45, 26. Well, they might get children on the no, no. Still. Might happen. At least we have the good tools. <laughs> Look at the average ages here. Oh boy. Oh, a child was born. Good. Keep up the good work. We need more children. We already have quite a few people that are just waiting for homes. Very much shy of homes here. Uh, let's see, who are you and why are you going down this way? You're a fisherman going for something to eat. Okay, so you live over there. You can walk on the river back there, so I don't need a tunnel through here necessarily. Or a bridge across here. I very much don't want the bridge across there, actually, because of the fish, because of the docks. Kind of fun to just zoom in and look at the food like that. Mushrooms. It's too far away from the gathering hut, that's why it's not being gathered. Okay, no more kids, up to five. And... Um, we're out of laborers. Oh, that's not good. Okay, cut down the number of miners. And stone cutters.
can't really cut down anything else. Other than the food, I suppose. We're still making food. And yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Definitely a demographic stop. So, yeah, we're going to be building quite a few houses, I suspect. If we can get the stone. Ugh. Okay, regardless, time for a break. Thank you for watching.